For Zena Whitfield's yeah. nameplate says it all, theater goddess. Greensboro has a lot of talent that has meant a lot to me over the years. 15 and a half years to be exact. Her work at Creative Greensboro, formerly the Drama Center, is to make words off a page come to life. I love taking it from page to stage. That very first reading, I'm always terrified. Is it going to come out? Is it going to be okay? She directed her first play at 15 years old. Now a countless number of shows and casts later, she hopes her impact goes beyond the stage door. Doing theater gives you self-expression. It gives you confidence. It uh, makes you articulate on stage or anywhere in a job interview. So I think there are life skills that you get from doing theater. People that are really good at what they do and also really care about what they do. And that's been her. Matt Adams was in the first play she directed in Greensboro called A Midnight Madness in Toyland. It was the start of a newfound dream for him, directing children's theater. And I watched how she got down on the kids' levels and talked to them like they were, you know, little adults and not small children. Yeah, I, I was in Shorts Tales. I was in Rumpelstiltskin, and so were you. Lainey and Harper Kaylee found their love of acting in shows directed by Rosina. She doesn't treat us like a little kid. She expects things from us that make us really proud. Even finding an understanding of the classic Shakespeare's Macbeth. Really good at breaking it down and making Shakespeare make sense. Um, which is something I, I don't I don't know how to do that. As Rosina wraps up her last play, all done over Zoom because of the pandemic, she says she'll always cherish the memories made on stage in Greensboro. It'll always be a big part of my life, no matter where I go from here. A lot of memories here. Yes, a lot. It's going to be hard to leave. Tyler Harden, Fox 8 News.